What's going on guys? Welcome back to Spooky's Gaming and Tutorials. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to do the backyard battleground glitch where you make the sky look like you're in space. For this glitch, you're going to want to go to the corn portal on the plant side in the backyard battleground. And then beat the final quest as normal. I recommend putting it on easy mode so that you beat it quicker because this glitch can take a while. So you just talk to the corn as usual. You go to the final one, zero bark 30. Make sure it's on easy. You activate it. Then you just want to beat it as fast as possible. And once you get to the end, on the final cutscene, you just respawn as a zombie and it should work. I've never had it not work and it seems pretty easy every time I do it. So I'm just gonna speed run this really quick. It does take a second. You just go to the plane as usual and then beat it as you normally would. Don't mind the dogs barking in the background. Not much I can do about that. But here, I'm just playing as normal. Just protect him. Now one trick for this is you want to shoot the corn cop cannon. You get three shots and immediately switch to full auto kernels. Because you can go like this. And it'll shoot three and you can immediately shoot with the corn cop kernels. And it kills almost everything. So this, this glitch does take a while to do because you have to wait for the whole quest to be done. And it can be pretty tedious at times if you're trying to do it quickly. But... It is one of the easier quests to do because it doesn't require any quick button pressing or anything. Just beat it as normal. I guess this also doubles as a tutorial on how to beat this. I mean, it's pretty self explanatory. You just shoot stuff. You gotta make sure they're not gonna kill them. Oh, they're swarming there. And if my mic sounds kind of weird, it got waterlogged a little bit ago, and I had to soak it in rice, and it got powder all in it. It was a whole ordeal, but I'm pretty sure it works now, but I might sound a little different. Oh boy, there's a lot of stuff coming for that man. Oh shoot. No, not kernel corn. No. Oh, I might lose this. Holy crap. I've never done so bad. If I lose this, that'll be very embarrassing. He's blocked! I can't hit him! Okay, there we go. Alright. This quest can be annoying because the trajectory where the plane is moving is like jerks your camera around in random directions and it's hard to aim. Come on, stay alive. Okay. It also doesn't show how much health he's at, so you don't know if he's about to die or not. Oh man, why is there so much stuff? Come on. Come on. Come on. There we go. That soldier kind of got overkilled. And we're close to the end because we're almost at the zombie base, so it shouldn't take much longer. Just when you're doing this quest, make sure to aim for the bigger threats. I say that as I ignore the Gigagar. Come on, there you go, he's gone. Pot is a lot of health. Oh shoot. This part gets really annoying because you lose visual on them completely. There's an area later where you go behind the zombie boss base and you can't see anything. And that area is usually where the kernel corn dies, so you gotta be careful. Alright, we're getting close to the end. He'll go right there and then start planting the cucumber nuke. And that's when you're not able to see him at all. So you want to try and kill everything before you get to that point. See right here, you can't see him at all and you get blocked by this thing. So it should end in a second here. Where he plants the cuke. Come on. And there we go. So now it's a 
It's a cutscene, so you just respawn. Switch characters. I mean, switch teams, and then choose a character. And boom, it'll do this. That means you've activated the glitch. It'll show the cutscene, but you'll spawn in as a zombie beforehand. And now you've done it. Now the entire sky looks like you're in space. You can see the planet over there. And there is no audio. There is some audio, but it's really weird what happens. Like, if I throw an imp punt, it won't make the throwing sound when you shoot. There won't be a shooting sound effect, but only when the shots collide with something. Like, all the audio is, like, halved. There's no portal sound effect, but you do spawn the plant base, so you gotta be careful. Stuff will start to spawn to attack you. But, as you can see, the entire sky looks like you're in space. This is also really good for showcasing characters, because if you go to the middle of the backyard battleground, it's completely lit up. I had to be frozen right there, you kidding me? There we go. See, everything is lit up. It looks like space. It's super bright in the middle, and this won't this won't deactivate no matter what you do in the backyard battleground unless you go to a multiplayer match or ops game. You can do whatever you want. You can um, start the flag. It won't change it. Everything still looks cool. If this helped, make sure to like and subscribe.